in our desire to advance Christ-centered recovery throughout the community and throughout the world. It's been exciting to help encourage and motivate um, other Christians to join that vision. One of the groups that we have been working with in this past year has been Atlanta. So as I began working with and developing relationships with people in recovery, of course, know Tom Reynolds and my brother Bill and the work that they were doing over here in Huntsville in his way, and began to see just the power in residential recovery for men. I began to see the traction that, that his way at uh, Huntsville got in, in the ministry and in men's lives and helping change lives. We could see very quickly that in this disease of addiction, there are so many things that need to be addressed that a comprehensive approach is essential. And I can see that in his way in Huntsville. And so for a long time, we've had the dream of, of doing something similar in Atlanta. I remember the first time we met with the group in Atlanta to start getting started, there were over 50, 60 maybe um, Christians galvanized together before we even started, excited and energized to see their faith in action, to be able to see that they can get off the sidelines and get in the game and really become a part of advancing God's kingdom in the lives of desperate people. His Way Atlanta officially opened its doors September 1st of 2021. It took us a while to get going. For a while we had four staff members and one client one resident or two and uh, so we were pretty intensive at that point but it did not take long for word to get out for traction to go and we are full we have uh, a capacity for 12 and we are at that capacity we've had several graduate um, three or four men have graduated we've had four men put on Christ in baptism. It was really exciting to see them join this vision and to start His Way Atlanta in September of this past year. Um, they're doing well, they're thriving, and I really hope that this becomes kind of a prototype that can be um, replicated all over the country, maybe all over the world.